hello and welcome back to Coins of More UK and the first video of 2021. I hope everyone had a fantastic Christmas and New Year and in today's video we are going to be going through um, a little bit of a backlog that I had just before the New Year kicked in. Um, I was so busy with lots and lots of different things that I just wasn't able to get many videos out. So in today's video I'm going to round everything up and uh, yeah it's just gonna be a really good catch up so i can move on to um my new videos for 2021 so there'll be a few different things to go through which i'm going to show you in a minute there'll be some new coins a few little bits that i've got for christmas and also a few other little goodies as well so stick around i'll try and not make this video too long but yeah it's going to be a really good look at things that i've um, received over the past couple of months so let's crack on with today's video and let's uh yeah let's have a look at some bits and bobs okay so the first um things that i didn't really get around to reviewing in detail are these um the further two um winnie the pooh coins now obviously we had piglet just there again another lovely design and i'm really happy with all three coins that were released in 2020 and i'm looking forward to the uh this year's releases as well but of course we had piglet really nice design and then also we had the christopher robin coin as well out of the three this one was my favorite but um yeah for some reason i just didn't get around to filming full reviews on these uh on these coins and i've had them for so long like i say life has been that busy unfortunately but there we go we had two stunning winnie the pooh coins and again, I can't wait to get these up on my shelves. Really nice collection. And of course, there is still six more to be released yet. So I'm looking forward to seeing what designs we get. But yeah, I was really happy with the three in 2020. And yeah, they're going to take up some room on the shelf once uh, once I've got all nine. But there we go. So yeah, two Winnie the Pooh coins. I am sorry that I didn't manage to film in-depth reviews of these. Uh, but yeah, everyone's uh, seen these coins. Fairly simple booklets. And uh, yeah, it's not much inside to read really, but again, two fantastic designs, and I'm, go I'm going to go and put these on my shelves now. Okay, so another thing that I received just before Christmas was this lovely, lovely package from Christina, also known as Pocket Poet. I'll leave all the descriptions um, in the box below, so please feel free to go and check out all her content. She writes poets, um, she's fantastic at art as well, she does some lovely drawings. If you haven't seen already, there was um, another video that my wife Amy did revealing one of the pieces of artwork that she designed for us. So, a very talented person and she's a lovely, lovely lady. And of course, we had some goodies inside here. Now, I have already opened these and had some bits on display, but for video purposes, we've had to wrap it all back up. So again, we've got a lovely, lovely envelope. Very posh, you can tell it's Pocket Poet with all this fancy stuff on it. And on the card, we had a lovely, lovely picture of my Greyhound Rebo. Merry Christmas. And inside, to Matt, Amy and boys. Merry Christmas and hope to see you in the new year. Thank you again for asking me to do your painting and thanks for being a great friend. Love Christina, XX, also known as Pocket Poet. So that was one lovely surprise. I do love the card though. I do love the card. My Greyhound Rebo. I did wonder why she um, sent me a message asking asking for a picture of my pet. I should, I should have sussed it out really, but I didn't. But just fantastic. I do love this and I will cherish this for life. It will be kept safe. And also we had a lovely gift. We had a lovely coin gift. Now, this has fell out a couple of times, but we've got the commem uh, commemorating the marriage of... Uh, the Prince of Wales and Lady Diana Spencer. Now, fun, funnily enough, I've not got this coin yet, so yeah, it will be added to my collection. And there we have Princess Di and Prince Charles. And inside, we've just got a few details. Yeah, the coin keeps falling out. I will put that back. Oops, don't want to be doing a bungle and touching that now. As always, just feel free to pause the video if you want to have a look at any of this information inside. And that's really cool. I mean, I've seen the coin, um, obviously on bits and bobs, but I didn't realise it came with its own little booklet. And of course, struck at the Royal Mint. So that was really nice, and I will be getting that up on my shelf very soon. 
thank you very much. And also we had uh, Super Super Marine Spitfire coin. And on the back there we've just got uh, great British design icons and the Union Jack making up the whole of the United Kingdom just there. That's really cool. I can't wait to get a little stand for this coin. It was really nice gifts. I, I do really appreciate these. It's awesome. And finally, um, yeah, so we did receive this at last. Now, I'm not quite sure what happened. I did order this off Amazon. But for some reason, in place of this book, I got a uh, cross-stitch book. So I have no idea what I did, whether I ordered the wrong thing. Yeah, God knows. Um, Amazon, you're, you're useless at times. But I did finally get a copy of um, Pocket Poets' um, poetry book. So of course it's called Echoes from My Pocket, Christina V. Griffiths, Griffiths, I can't say a second name right, um, Christina, I do apologise, but you get the gist. And it's just fantastic, and I have had a read of some of these poems inside, and they're just stunning. They really, really are, and, you can, and so much um, effort's gone into this. It really is a nice book, so um, again, I'll leave a link in the uh, description box below, please feel free to go and check out... Um, Pocket Poets social medias and of course please feel free to support her by buying this fantastic book. So to Matt and Amy, I hope you enjoy the book. Love Christina and Echoes from my pocket. Let's put you over there for a minute because you're sticking. And what I did like about it is the mentions, which were really this was touching. We've got some acknowledge, acknowledgements just there. And where are we? There we are, coins and more UK. Look at that. Yeah, absolutely chuffed. And of course, um, to be named amongst some fantastic coin tubers and legends of the country reverse, we've got James, we've got Laughter, Katie John, Katie Jones, oh god, Tongue Twister Katie, um, Christopher Clex, Coins of More UK, Bungle and Lady M, Master Dan Temple, and Caledonian Coins. It was, it was um, really nice to be mentioned in this book. It's, it's nice to know that I have brought you some support and friendship. And uh, yeah, the coin tube reverse is awesome. But please feel free to go and check out um, Christina's poetry book and of course buy a copy and support her work. Um, it, it's fantastic and we all need to get behind these small businesses, artists and you know people like Christina that go to a lot of time and effort to write lovely books like this. So again, Christina, thank you so much for all of this. It was an absolutely fantastic um, surprise to open all this. And um, I can't apologise enough that this video is going out so late. But again, there's a little plug for you, and just thank you so much for all these wonderful gifts. It was really, really appreciated. Okay, I'm moving on to another nice little surprise. It is this. We had a lovely Christmas card from the absolutely awesome Purple Fairy, otherwise known as Sandra, for anyone who didn't know her real name. So we've got a lovely card, handcrafted, to Matt, Amy and the boys. Happy Christmas, have a good one, love from Purple Fairy. And of course, um, Purple Fairy is the um, the mother of the coin tuberverse, and she is one of the most nicest, genuest, most loveliest people that I've ever had the chance to meet. And I'm hoping it won't be too long before um, I can come and see you again down at the Mint, or if you're ever down um, Skegness Way having some ice cream and fish and chips, I'll be sure to um, pop by and uh, come and have a cup of coffee with you, or hot chocolate, whichever it may be. Again, thank you so much for this lovely um, Christmas card, Purple Fairy. And again, sorry it's so late getting this video out. But I just love it. And I will cherish this. It will be going up on my coin shelf. Another stunning piece of work by the awesome Purple Fairy. So thank you so much. Again, I will leave um, Purple Fairy's links in the description box below. Please feel free to go and check out her channels. They are absolutely fantastic. And some of the videos she kicks out are just so lovely as well. A very good friend, a massive supporter of my channel, and one of the nicest people you will, you will ever meet. So thank you so much for this Purple Fairy, and uh, yeah, it was really nice to receive this Christmas card. So thank you so much, and I shall see you very soon. Now, I totally forgot I was um, expecting this, so when it turned up through the letterbox, I was, I was quite surprised. I was like, Amy, what's this? What have you ordered? But I did forget. I had uh, requested these. And I can't, I can't believe what's inside, it's just absolutely awesome. I've seen many of these on YouTube videos, and it's just great to have a selection as well. So let's tip these out, and you're, you're going to know who these are from. Is there enough room on my table? Let's spread these out a little bit and have a look. Just make sure there's 
No, there's, there's more inside. Angels old. And, and I think, I think that's about it. Okay, so these are from um, Paul over at um, Coin Patrol. And I did ask for these, I said I've got these stickers, blah, 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 blah. And he, he kind of said, yeah, I'm quite happy to send you some stickers. And to get all this lot, I'm just so overwhelmed, really. There's, there's so many. I mean, Amy's already taxed a few. I do apologise. So we've got some skulls. All these um, skull ones, Amy's pinched. She absolutely loved them. They were gone, mate. They were just, yeah, they disappeared and they're all dotted around the house. And that's one of and we've got some uh, smiley faces. These are just really cool stickers. They're absolutely fantastic. I do love these. These are going to be all over my house. As soon as my kids see these. They've not seen them yet because I've been waiting to do this video. But the kids will go mad. And of course he's kindly did me some signs as well. We've got some smaller ones and some larger ones. Coins and more UK. And these are just awesome. I do love these. <laughs> they are really cool. We've got Mr Bean. Again, good old Scottish flag. Because I am I am part Scottish. I've got a Scottish flag on my arm, if no one's ever realised. I am part Scottish. I've got a bit of Scottish blood in me. Not as much as Jamesy and Caledonian coins and coin cupboard. Yeah, but I've got a bit of Scottish in me. Okay, so. Uh, more stickers. These are just fantastic. I can't believe how good some... These are just awesome. So many different designs. Let's try and turn some... Oh, oh we have got a little... No, oh, how did I miss that? So of course Coin Patrol, go and check out his channel and of course his um short he's got a, um, a channel with um, little 10 second shorts and stuff like that. Go and check that one out as well. Absolutely fantastic chap and he's got a fantastic sense of humour. Um, I do enjoy watching his content. So uh, here we go. Hi Matt, hope you had a great Christmas. Here are some logo stickers as promised. All the best, Paul at Coin Patrol. Just fantastic, Paul. I mean I'm so overwhelmed by all these. I just probably expected a few of these to be fair. Sort of chucking all these extra bits and bobs. Union Jack as well. And um, what else have we got? Special edition. I think if I was going to wear a sticker, this would be the one. Special edition. Oh, this is just brilliant. I'm trying to flip them all over. As you can see in my videos, I am king of being organised. Let's see, have we got anything else? Oh, some little lovely Disney characters. My kids, my kids are going to tax these and all they are. Oh, here we go, look at that. Darth Vader. As soon as I see Darth Vader, it just reminds me of Christopher Collects. So I'm going to put that back down and hide it. <laughs> now, this is just fantastic, Paul. Thank you so much for all these stickers. Um, these will, will get put, put to such fantastic use. I have so many ways that I can use these stickers. So, again, thank you so much. Very overwhelming. Um... The generosity of some people is just flabbergasting. It, it's really cool. So of course, I will leave um, some description details for Paul in the um, description box below. Please feel free, feel free to go and check out his social medias and YouTube channel. He does put out some fantastic coin content. And like I said before, he's got a fantastic sense of humour. And his videos are certainly a little bit different to what some of us uh, guys and girls make. So... Yeah, if you fancy watching something a little bit different, head over to Coin Patrol. And of course, um, be subscribed as well, because you could be in with a chance of winning a Coup Gardens with um, Coin Patrol's um, latest giveaway. So if you're subscribed, you will be notified about that giveaway, and please feel free to enter for yeah a fantastic chance to win a Coup Gardens 50p coin. And there we go, let's... Um, I'm just going to leave all that... leave all this there. There's so much to pack away. What a cool backdrop. And there we go, they're just um, some lovely bits and bobs that I've received over Christmas. Okay, so as for this video, they're just the last bits and bobs that I really had to try and get done before Christmas, which I didn't get time to do, unfortunately. But for the first video of 2021, um, starting off with the fantastic generosity of people that support my channel and fellow coin tubers, I can't thank you enough. If you did enjoy this video, please leave me a like. And of course, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please feel free to do so. If you want to leave me a comment in the box below, that would be fantastic as well. I do endeavour to answer as many of your questions as possible. And uh, what else is there? Have I done the notification bell thing yet? I don't think I have. 
yeah, if you press the notification bell, you'll be notified when I upload a new video. All that jazz. I think I've done it all. I might have forgotten something off. I've not recorded a video for weeks. I'm a bit rusty. I do need to get back in the game for 2021. But again, um, a big thank you to everyone that always goes out the way to support my channel. We have such a fantastic time making YouTube videos and engaging within the community. You're all awesome. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, please remember, there's always two sides to every coin if you take the time to look. Bye for now. Bye.